Hey there guys, Clandor back again with some more Game of Thrones. Uh, uh, let's just resume the game. We're in the middle Your of like a cutscene thing. Your sister can help us. Although just a handmaiden, she has Marjorie Tyrell's favor. And Lady Marjorie's betrothal to the king may be enough So to basically what happened was, uh, last episode, there was this guy who was all up in my business and was like, No, screw you. You may be a lord, but screw you. And he's all like, I'm gonna go talk to the master lord. Thing. And then um, they were like, okay, we need this girl over here because she can actually help us. And then now we're her. This, is, this game definitely likes to switch between characters a lot. Oh, that was, that was useful to look at. Look at the ironwood box. It's more of a chest, but okay, let's call it an ironwood box. That, that works. <gasps> Dude, is that money right there? Heck yeah, let's take some money. I can't take it. I can look I at it. This coin to remember him. What a strange place, Essos. Yeah, it's very strange. Totally agree. Oh, okay, so I guess this is all my crap anyway. So I guess I don't have to take it. I thought I was in someone else's room. That was a great thing to look at. I had lots of dialogue talking about it. It was very kind of Lady Marjorie to give this to me. One hundred percent kind. It once belonged to Lady Elena. Anything else to look at? There's an unfinished letter. We should finish it. What's the difference between looking at and reading? Oh, that was, let's read the unfinished letter. I thought that's what looking at it would do. Much excitement here in King's Landing for the coming wedding. Lady Marjorie has proven to be quite popular throughout the city. Well, you know, when you're hot, you, you can be quite popular. Although I know it would be impossible under the circumstances. I miss all of you. And I look forward to the day you can. Uh, I think I know why she stopped writing the letter. You see daisy. Dusty old tome. Dude, if I read that, will I get like a magic spell or something? What, what the heck is going on back here? Why is this all blurry? It's weird. Ugh, okay, let's let's learn a magic spell. Come on, come on. I hope it's like fireball. Oh, like okay. long strider. <laughs> he likes this. His. Shut up. There was a joke there. There was. I swear. Oh, let's look at the window. Let's not look out the window. Let's look at the window. I'm so glad I. Good. I'm so glad I looked at that blurry window. Why is everything over there so blurry? Why? Letter from mother. <gasps> mother! What's it say? It troubles me to even ask this of you. But you must appeal to Lady Marjorie to intervene on our behalf. She is our best hope and can be a powerful ally. Especially now when your family so desperately needs her help. You know what? I'll try my best to butter up to her and stuff. And be like, hey, Lady Marguerite, you're um, so cute and hot. And, and, you know, you have huge amount of land and stuff. And hopefully that'll, like, win her over. Who are you? Are you a slave? Oh, are you my slave? I didn't mean to disturb you. I Did can you come back later if you'd like. No, you can come back here and I need some cuddles. Let him in. It's fine. Come in. Well, obviously he needs something. So, oh, he's just cleaning stuff. Oh, he's put No, he's putting stuff in. Oh, he's going to light. Your pardon, lady, but you all right? Am I? I my ask. You seem rather upset. I'm just worried about my I'm worried too. He noticed my honesty. Good. You know what? He's going to light my world on fire. And by that, I mean he's going to light my cold brazier thing so I won't be cold. You work for Lady Marjorie? I may be wrong. You could be. Seems like you do. I am her maid, handmaiden. I was gonna say maid hadden, but that 
It's not a thing you in anything like ever. Thank you. I saw Lady Marjorie just this morning outside the royal set, talking to Queen Cersei. Oh, quick care say. <clears throat> I don't like her. No, 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 no. I like Joffrey more than Kersey. That's saying something. Much, but it was definitely an argument. You were eavesdropping. No, not at all. I was just passing by and I heard them arguing about House Forrester. House Forrester? <gasps> What's that? That's that's like my family. That's 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 like know. me. Forgive me if I was mistaken. I hope you're not in any kind of trouble. No, my family were just like part of the rebellion and stuff, and now they're just not. Bleh. You see and hear all sorts of things when people don't even know you're there. Does that mean you eavesdrop on me too, huh? 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 Punk? Oh, punk, punk, punk. Come back here, punk. You notice my honesty. Ah, oh, it's Marjorie. Lady Marjorie. You're early. She looks like a snake. There would be time for us to talk. Come. You look like a snake, Marguerite. Let's discuss. Oh, is it about my family that uh, Kersey wants to kill and stuff? There's another person. From the day you arrived in High Garden, I thought of you more as a friend than as my handmaiden. A dear friend, in fact. Thank you, my lady. And you know how I feel about what's happened to your family. I feel your pain as if it were my own. Well, that's nice of you. I need your help, actually. Yes, I don't care. I'm cutting straight to the chase. I, she seemed kind of violent, though, when she grabbed my arm. What is it? You must understand there are limits to what I can say, especially here in King's Landing, now that I am to be queen. Doesn't that mean that you are the queen and have more power and should be able to say more stuff? Raises questions at a time I can least afford. Oh, self cornered me this morning outside the royal set. Are you gonna get rid of me? She mentioned the northern girl in my service, and she painted you a traitor. Wow, she was very pleased with herself. Her face was full. Ah, I'm just gonna say it. I'm not a traitor. I'm not a traitor, of course not. It's only an excuse to torment you, and by extension, me. Man, you're doing something she with your hair here. Ah, I don't know, it's something though. Apology of some sort for what I don't know, but she's waiting for us now, and I promise. Oh, Kersey and her blah 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 blah, blah plotting. Not important. I cannot afford any conflict with Cersei with the wedding. I'll do it as you ask. Even though you get to marry Joffrey no matter what, and then, tell her what she wants. To and then he dies. So, see if the queen I mean, spoilers. I really okay. Seriously, that was like season three. And it's like season five now. It was at least season four, and it's season five now. Come on, it was in the books too. Don't get angry at me. You'll be fine. I'm sorry. I know you will. We'll see spoilers later, sooner. Say another. I hope I don't accidentally reveal any secrets in them. Good luck. Oh, thank you. I thought that other chick was gonna be all like, I, oh, I was, I was just sort of having a little spasm there for a second, but, but I'm, I'm good now. I thought that other chick was gonna be like, I don't trust you. Get on my face. Oh. Do I get to be all like, yo? <gasps> Is that Tyrion? You Yay! <laughs> Finally, something good about this game. Tyrion. Oh, I do have to walk. I'm coming. I'm, I'm slowly coming. Come, come, come. One second. Coming. I'm almost there. <laughs> I swear. Ah, Lady Marjorie. Aren't you looking lovely this Oh, he was talking to, uh, to me. Too. Never mind. Your Grace? Uh, one second, I'm almost there. Almost. Okay, I'm there. Allow me to introduce Lady Mira of House Forrester. Hello. How are you guys doing? Oh, bow your head. Honored, your Grace. Hmm. Yet not honored enough to <laughs> No, you're carousel. House Forrester is a northern house loyal. No, she probably says something. Arthur, if I, I beg your pardon, your grace. I wasn't talking to you. 
I want to hear from the girl. And here you if shall. You are loyal to the king. Perhaps you should ask the new Lord Forrester. He's not here, is he? She is. Yes, your grace. To, to the, the one true king. True <laughs> king. <laughs> yes, she didn't say which. Yay. Girl is clever. Thank you. She only I try to be clever. I care what she said. And I don't care about I'm you at all. From the girl of the north. If you would give her the chance to explain. Perhaps she can explain why the foresters have been loyal bannermen to House Stark for centuries. A house of traitors. Oh. They were our wardens of the north. We all served at the pleasure of the king. Yeah. Clever girl. Thank you. Clever girl. Tyrion should have been in Jurassic World or something. And she would have us believe. Your answer did not say, "Well, I don't want to satisfy her." I don't care. House willing to swear fealty to your new liege lord, Roose Bolton. Oh. Roose Bolton also. Yeah, he also served the Starks. Like, how come we're traitors, but he's not? His loyalty to the crown by bringing their house to a swift and sudden end. Blah blah blah. Old allegiances are not easily abandoned, but now that the war is apparently not to the Boltons. To build and forge new alliances. There are ships and shields to be built, and Joffrey will need a steady supply of iron. Nah, Joffrey won't be needing much stuff soon, considering what happens to him at the Purple Wedding. But I trust we can rely on House Forrester. Forrester Ironwood does seem rather unique. Many I desire. Forrester Ironwood is highly sought after in the Seven Kingdoms. So I'm told. I won't dishonor myself. Oh, she's gonna remember a lot of things about me. Wielding a battle axe with the northern army. Can I just grab like a knife right now and just stab Kersey? <laughs> Our dear Marjorie here was betrothed to Renner Baratheon on the false assumption that he would one day rule the Seven Kingdoms. Can we fault her for her mistake? Should she be held accountable? I think. I won't judge her. Like yeah, I, I'm good. If only one could flit through life without ever holding an opinion of their own. If there's a point to this, I hope you find it quickly. Oh, why can't Sharian be the king? Screw you, Kersey. This city alone is filled with all sorts. You know what, Kersey? You have no loyalty to anybody, so you are a hypocrite. Who knows what lurks within their hearts? Who knows what lurks? Lur lur lurks in your heart, Kersey. Here in service to Lady Marjorie. One can only assume her interests are yours. Yet loyalty to a king, that must be Oh yes, I'm loyal to the one true king, like I said. And I said that me I said it and the very person whom you serve. What would you do then? I'm sure she Let the would girl answer the question. Go on. I won't be conflicted. <laughs> Well, this whole thing has been a waste of time, so you just... I don't know what to choose, honestly. Okay. Yeah, this sucks. I'll just go with the king because I bet you that what she wants to hear. Well said. I was beginning to worry you didn't have your priorities straight. Oh, shut up. She is a threat to the crown, isn't she? Oh yeah, I'll totally become the next queen. Yep, me, right there. I'm not quite sure what to make of her. Not surprising, I suppose, for a northern girl. I know exactly what to make of you, though. I'm not gonna say it, though. I'd like a word with you, if I may. 
Of course, your grace. Did she just give me those evil eyes? I said what the queen wanted to say. So, can I go? Or... Do a, um... You out. Well, thank you. This may come as a surprise, but I met your father once, at the tourney at Lannisport. Even then, he didn't trust Roose Bolton. Nobody trusts Roose Bolton. Nobody. Father struck me as an honorable man. He probably was. And that's and probably why he's dead. His loss. These would be trying times for your family. My family is in danger. These are trying times, my lord. My family fears what might happen now that the Boltons rule the North. They must still answer to the crowd. You shouldn't forget that, nor should they. That Okie dokie. took courage to so publicly declare your loyalty to Joffrey for all to hear. I mean, Marjorie was humiliated, although Cersei seemed quite pleased. I mean, it was quite first impression I of course found it all highly entertaining it was my sister and I like I mean I can't if I say I, I'm not gonna say something bad I can't I can't say something bad that'll be bad so I said something good it is the master of coin who decides such the crown needs oh please she controls the master of the coin whatever what are you suggesting Yes. You suggesting? I suppose the crown could be persuaded to secure Ironwood from House Forrester. Lady Marjorie might not look favorable. Oh wait, you're the current. <gasps> That's right, he's the man of Arsene. Although what would be amusing for me might prove rather dangerous for you. Oh, everything's dangerous for me right now. I was part of the traitor alliance, so doesn't. It's yes, I am. To take your Tyrion. Please. You are a brave girl, aren't you? I want to say brave, more like I have to kind of do this for so that my now, family doesn't you'll die. Excuse me, I promised Sansa I would join her for dinner. <gasps> Sansa. Three beautiful bottles of Dornish wine await my arrival. The mere thought. Of I hope we meet again. I do. I honestly do. I like you. Nothing would make Cersei happier. Until then, be careful. Oh, it's all about your sister. You can't enjoy my company. Blah 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 blah. Okay, so bye. Nice talking to you. Hello, person. I was worried. Why were you worried? What happened to me? What happened to you? What's going on? Cersei has a way of looking at you. Yeah. Oh, oh well, well. I don't need to. I don't need to worry you. It's fine. Everything's fine. Cersei is known for being rather. She's known for a lot of things, to be honest, but yeah, definitely. Oh, that sounds exciting. To be fair, it's kind of an honor just to be... Gross. 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 I'm told he has a paramour, which I doubt is Dawn. Uh, he is quite handsome and quite passionate, from what I've heard. Perhaps Lady Marjorie can make the right introductions. Who knows? We might meet. Her oh yeah, friends. handmaidens that'll marry a prince and kings. I can only imagine what that would be like. I can imagine it, and that is um, impossibility land. Would you marry Joffrey? The land of impossibility. He does have a certain look about him, and he's always <laughs> not to Joffrey. I'm uh, willing to marry, but not Joffrey. No. I would marry him. Imagine the power you would have. You would have no power. Joffrey but would hit you, you until you comply. Hell, oh, actually, he he wouldn't hit you. I lied. He would tell his guards to hit you until you comply. <laughs> What a perfect match. Sir Bron and what are you doing? Well We were just having fun. Ah. We were just having fun. 
Come on, I know you like to have fun. This is not a game. It's a battle plan. Babe. Allies and enemies can be made with It is a Game of Thrones, so men who are powerful. It's a Game of Thrones. So by your display mirror. Good. That's what I tried to do. I'm just glad it's over. You're well, actually no. I didn't want her to be pleased. I was trying to skirt the edges of what I could get by with. Until the end. I was like, screw it, it's the end. Some perceived slight to smooth over. I fear it will only get worse when I am queen. Once I know your true heart, the lords and ladies will have no choice but to love you. Don't worry, lots of men already love her. Um. It's hard, yep. You showed Cersei your true heart, she would stab it with a fork. Yeah, she would you stab it with a fork and a spoon and a knife and a spork. She would stab it with anything she could get her hands on. But I know you must fear what the Boltons might do to your family. I do appreciate Oh yeah, they would kill my family and worse. So I know I know exactly. There's been something on my mind. Something important. Ask her for help. I'm I'm shameless. I don't care. I did have a favor to ask of you in return. I don't care. I'm shameless. Just what ask. You to say you can say it in front of Sarah. There are no secrets between us. I'm gonna go ask Tyrion for help. I'm gonna ask you for help. I'm gonna ask that boy who came in my room for help. Ah, oh, whatever she can say. I don't care. She's probably a spy, but whatever. Our mother needs our help. Probably the vaguest but most helpful answer. I wouldn't otherwise ask this of you, but my mother insisted. It's about my family. Ramsay Snow. What would you have me do? I don't know. You're the like freaking queen. Suffer if Ramsay is left to do as he likes. She thought if a raven could be sent to the Boltons to let them know House Forrester has the protection of the crown. I know it's a lot to ask of you, and I wouldn't otherwise, but. She insisted. But I am shameless, so. That is no small request. Especially now. Nothing is a small request in this stupid kingdom. But my mother has left me no choice. She insisted. Joffrey knows only too well your family fought for the Starks. Oh, I'm sure you're... I'm sure everyone in the King's Landing knows that. Is the situation that dire? You can't, my lady. King Joffrey won't like it. Just think how we turned on Lady Sansa. It is that dire, my lady. I fear for my family's safety. Squinting at me, being all like bleh. No, Mira. If Cersei were to find out. Well, I mean, you are adored Don't by the king. Bully you. you have power over him, Lady Marjorie, as no one else does. Not even his mother. You are the queen. Carisay is just an old hag with no power anymore. Very well. I'll make your request, but I cannot promise anything. Yay, thank you. I will send a raven to my family at once. Thank you, Marjorie. I have no shame. None. None whatsoever. Uh, I'll just help anybody. Can anyone help my family? You over there. You help me. Okay. Thank you. You over there. Help me. Okay. Thank you. Th you. Yes. No. You. I'm going to pause it here though and end the video. That was a long chapter. But uh, thanks for watching everybody. Tune in next time for the next chapter part thingy. Anyways, uh, thanks for watching. I'm so dumb. But as always, stay classy.